Wow. I love coffee. For some reason, coffee, it just... For some people, coffee, it's just an energy booster. For others, coffee is just a, a habit of just drinking their cup of coffee in the morning. For me, when I drink coffee, it draws me closer to God. Like, I can be so tired in the morning, but when I get to the office, I have my cup of coffee. Oh my God, I'm so positive, I'm, I'm, I'm uplifted. It's kind of crazy. I don't know if you feel me, but that's how I feel when I drink coffee. I love coffee. And if you don't know what I'm drinking here, it's coffee, but it's not an ordinary coffee. It's my favorite, Bustelo. Go look it up, go check them out. They're good. There's not a paid advertisement, I'm just, Telling you how I feel. That's what I like. Coffee. Hey, what's up guys and welcome again to another episode of Be Creative, Be Great. Um, I love coffee by the way, I'm, I'm, I'm still zipping on my coffee just, just to throw that in there. Um, anyways, so what, I'm, what I wanted to, to express today was just how I came about wanting to, to do a YouTube channel. Like I'm involved with so many different things, I'm involved in my church, you know, I go to work, I have a, a normal, you know, a job that I commute long distances to get to um but that's not the case it's 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 more of me being creative me being a creative person so i was like you know what everybody loves video content people wants video content i know they can text and they can put a tweet here and there and they can do all these other types of uh, of of means of, of being creative but i i just think that youtube is just such a massive outlet to just Express yourself, put things out there, you know, informational. It can be educational. It can be, you know what I mean? It can be creative. It can just talk about whatever you want to talk about. It can be a vlog where you just discuss your life every single day, which, you know, there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, I started off watching Casey Neistat putting up videos all the time of just him doing a bunch of things. And listen, I got intrigued by it and I got involved in it. I was like, wow, this is so cool. He's he's incorporating so many different things. And now he's doing amazing things, which is which is awesome. Uh, so shout out to you, Casey Neistat. Um, but anyways, so why I decided to go the YouTube route was because I can be expressive. I can just talk about things that I want to talk about, you know, uh, that maybe some people are not talking about. Or maybe they are, but they're just not, you know, speaking about it the way I want to, you know, uh, or speak about it. So that's what made me go through this channel and create a YouTube channel because I, I also have a, a clothing line that, that I'm establishing called Peramino, P-E-R-I-M-E-N-O. And I can funnel that, that outlet through this channel itself. I do music. I write music. I was uh, a part of a, a music uh, group a pop group called Renewed. I can funnel the music in through here as well and maybe in some of my B-rolls or whatever the case is uh, that I'm doing. Um, so there, there's so many ways that you can funnel, you know, what you do with a single YouTube channel. So that's what I'm pretty much trying to do with this channel in itself. I'm just trying to, you know, funnel all the things that I'm doing, all my creative stuff, whether it be the fashion, whether it be in the music, whether it just be my 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 normal day to day stuff that that I just like to do, and just put it in a video. Let everybody see what's 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 going on, what I'm up to, what I'm doing. Um, uh, maybe give tutorials, speak about you know some trips that I've gone to, like I did the Nam series. Um, that was pretty cool. I did some reviews on on some technology, you know. So I I can talk about so many different things, and this outlet gives me the opportunity to do so. YouTube, you know, allows me to 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 speak 
to the entire world and, and let them know what I'm doing, not only through videos to see what I'm about or to see what I'm doing, but also to, to get feedback from other YouTubers that are out there, you know what I mean? I started off, you know, just doing these videos, nor normal, I would say pretty much basic, but then I started getting into color grading, wanting to, to correct the, the video footage so it looks nice and clear when it's uploaded, and all those little things, you know, they, they just came with practice and with looking at other YouTube videos. So, YouTube has been a major, major, uh, uh, inspiration to me because I can just look at look for something that I'm interested in do a quick search find it and boom um, it's it's right there I, I can get information on it so I said wow why not you know do a YouTube video myself where I can just you know speak about certain things that I want to speak about and I think it's a great outlet and I think it's it's something that that's that's awesome I think uh, if you're a creative person you should definitely have a YouTube channel um, um, get away from the fear of just like you know having the camera in your face like it is now but at least you can go ahead and edit it if you don't like it just delete the certain pieces and add the pieces you want to go back into it so it's it's fairly easy um it's just getting uh, going over that fear of just looking into a camera maybe but if you just take the time and you and you do it and you just you know say you know what I want to I want to speak about this or I would like to talk about this I wonder what somebody you know is going to say or think about it hey listen so what you you never know what's going to happen until you try it so that's what made me go into this YouTube route whereas you know I I I'm a big fan of it in itself I love the YouTube environment in general you know i i like that it's so easily accessible there's 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 a bunch of stuff some of it's good some of it's bad but hey listen you get to choose whatever whatever you want to see so um that's why i i went this route and i and i think if you're a creative person you should go the same route you should definitely have a youtube channel you should definitely open up and give it a try see how it goes and just go from there but like everyone that i've learned from on youtube like a casey neistat like a peter mckinnon um i they always just said just be consistent so it doesn't matter if you're starting off something basic, small video footage, a phone, a camera, a decent camera, a bad camera. It doesn't matter what it is as long as the content is, is there. Just be consistent with it. So that's what I'm trying to do with, with this channel. And, and that's what I'm, um, I'm trying to let everyone know who's also in the creative world that hasn't yet opened up a YouTube channel, that you should open up a YouTube channel. You, you should engage with the YouTube world, especially if you want to market certain things. Like myself, like I want to market my music. I want to market you know my clothing that, that I'm working on. So it's a bunch of things that, that you can just consolidate into just one outlet, YouTube. So um, those are my two cents, and that's what I wanted to share with you today. Um, just as far as like what made me go into to YouTube and 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 how I've I've grown to even love it a little bit more because I'm constantly thinking, what am I going to speak about this time? You know, what can I speak about this time? What happened throughout my day that I'm you know something you know great happened while I was on my commute and you know I took some video footage of it and I can use it in. In my channel, you know, I I think it's I think it's so cool to engage with people. It's also a networking tool, believe it or not. You can get you get to network with with people around the world. So if it, well, while you're doing this video, if you connect with somebody or if somebody saw the video, they love the video, they put a comment in there, they send you a DM on your Instagram, whatever uh, uh, sources of, uh, of of social media you have, they hit you up and say, hey, listen, let's collaborate, let's do something. Boom, there you go. You just you know connected with somebody that you probably wouldn't have connected if you didn't have a YouTube channel. So that's why I'm I'm actually uh, talking about it today because I was just on the train today. I'm coming home and I'm like, all right, I got to upload another video. And the first thing that popped in my head was like, you know, why, why did I create a YouTube channel? Why did I do it? So I just wanted to let everyone know this is the reason why I created a YouTube channel and, and why you should also, why you should create a channel if there's something, if there's a message that that you want to, um, I don't know, let the world know. If you're a creative person, let people know how creative you are, how talented you are, and just, you know, by simply doing a video and you you never know where, where that goes. I just do it because I, I, I want to be able to express myself and, and just get stuff out there, let people see what, what, what I'm doing and what I'm about. And, and, and that's about it. You know, I get to just you know, be me. I get to talk about God because I, I love God, you know, not because of the coffee, but in general, 
I just I just love God. I have a relationship. You know, I'm I'm a I'm a youth leader with me and my wife. We work with teenagers from 13 to about 20, 22 years old, and 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 it's great. And I get to speak about certain moments on on the channel itself. So listen, it's it's an awesome experience. It's great. It's cool. Um, and, and you can do it at the benefit of your own home, your own room, wherever you want to set yourself up. As long as you got a camera, as long as you got a microphone and you got a quick editing, uh, uh, video editing program, you're pretty much all set. So don't make it complicated. If you're a creative person, you know, let everyone know how creative you are. Show everyone know what projects you're working on. Cause you never know. It might be a project that somebody is looking to do and you might be that person to, to give them the input and insight that they need. So with that being said, thanks again for watching uh, another episode of Be Creative, Be Great. And if you haven't yet subscribed, please do so. Like it, share it, put a comment in there. Let me know what you think I want to speak about. And listen, hey, if you want to send me some coffee, go ahead. Just DM me. Send me a comment. Send me some coffee. I like all types of coffee, not just that one specifically. I just, you know, have that one in my possession at the moment. And it's good. So... Again, thanks again for watching. And until next time, um, be creative, be great. Later. Hey, by the way, I got these cool Nerf guns. I was with my nephews a couple of days ago and they gave a good idea. I don't think I should share the idea yet, but anyways. We got these Nerf guns and we just had a blast. Maybe I might do a review on them.